Dear students, how are you? Hope you are well by the grace of Almighty Allah. You know that an unknown unseen virus has stunned the people of the whole world. Every day we find the news of dead and infected peoples in newspaper and radio and television. So we cannot continue our classes in our school premises. That's why Bangladesh government and the Ministry of Education has arranged online class for you. Besides, many educational institutions and are also arranged their online class. So, we uh, also arranged online class for you. So, at first, I also introduced with you, I am Mosavajir Rahman Ripon, assistant teacher English, Goldhart Secondary High School, Charpation Bhola. Dear students, you know that Ministry of Education has given you a short syllabus that will complete by 30 days. So, in this syllabus, uh, in class 8, you can do two topics of grammars. They are word change and changing sentence. So, today I discuss with you some basic rules about uh, changing sentence. So, let's start. Look at the board. Here, you see a sentence that is, he is a clever boy and if we turn into negative, we can say that he is not a clever boy. In the right side, you can see that here is the same sentence, he is a clever boy, but I transform it. He is not a full boy. Please listen carefully, dear students. In the first sentence, the meaning of the sentence is, is totally changed. But in the second sentence, the meaning of the sentence is not changed, only the formation of the sentence is changed. So, where the meaning of the sentence is changed. This is called conversion of sentence. Con conversion of sentence. But where the meaning of the sentence is not changed, only the formation of the sentence is changed, that sentence is called transformation of sentence. Transformation of sentence. Transformation of sentence. So, your syllabus has the conversion of sentence, not the transformation of sentence. We will discuss transformation sentence in our next class, that is class 19. So dear students, now I told you how we transform affirmative to negative, sorry, how we convert affirmative to negative. Look at the sentence, Runa will attend the function. And this sentence, I transfer this sentence into negative, Runa will not attend the function. Here, 
you see i use not before the auxiliary verb will i use not sorry i use not after the auxiliary verb will i use not after the auxiliary verb will so i hope you know what is auxiliary verb they are am is are was or have has had shall will so if any sentence is auxiliary verb you can change the sentence by using not before sorry after that auxiliary verb to transform it into negative in the second sentence you see that he goes to office at 9 o'clock he goes to office at 9 o'clock and i transform the sentence he does not go to office at 9 o'clock dear students you see that he goes to office at 9 o'clock here auxiliary verb is absent here no auxiliary verb is found in this sentence so if the auxiliary verb is absent in any sentence how we can transform this sentence into negative look i use he does not go to office at 9 o'clock if any sentence has no auxiliary verb if we transform the sentence into negative then we will have to we will have to make sure that what kind of sentence is it what is the formation of this sentence is it present past so if it is present tense we use do not or does not we use do not or does not before the main verb so if the subject is second person singular then we will use does not before the verb and if the sentence is first person second person if the subject is first person second person and third person plural we will use do not before the verb so here goes is a base form of the verb so and he is third person singular so i use does not and uh i use go here goes i use here into negative uh, i use here go why because uh if we use does not we will uh, uh we expand yes from the verb in the third sentence you say they arrange the picnic in the third sentence you see they arrange the picnic so here i use do not to transform in into negative because arrange is also a also the base form of the verb but here they is third person plural so i use do not to transform it negative in the fourth sentence you see that he gave me a glass of water he gave me a glass of water here i you i write he did not give me a glass of water here gave is the first form of the verb so i use did not to transform it into negative and i use the present form of the verb gave he did not give me a glass of water hope you will understand how you change affirmative to negative or how you convert affirmative sentence into negative thank you very much hope we uh, keep 
uh, file and try to stay at home and use the rules of hygiene by following so use uh, uh, follow the rules of hygiene thank you